Body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins. What's up, Batty Army? It's a new day. It's a new vlog. Today I'm giving you my one week keto diet update and um, I actually just weighed myself and I am pleased. It's week one, today is February 4th and I've officially lost 6.4 pounds. Yo, y'all don't know how hype I am right now. The first week I lost 6.4 pounds. Bitch, what? Girl, I'm so excited, baby. But yeah, I'm down 6.4 pounds and I'm just so happy that um, this diet is actually working. And I'm, I actually like this diet. Like, it's I could make this a lifestyle. You know what? From now on, I'm not calling this a diet. This is a lifestyle for me, okay? This is a lifestyle. And I like this lifestyle. Like, this, this eating, this drinking a lot of water, this going to the bathroom every two minutes to pee. I'm here for it. She's here for it and I just like this and I'm going to continue on this lifestyle, baby, baby. So guys, my ketone strips finally came in the mail and I'm about to check if I'm in ketosis. Like I need to check on the chart here to see where on the chart am I? Like where I need to see like where am I? So what I'm going to do is I'm about to pee in a cup. And then I'm going to take out one of these strips and I'm going to dip it in there. They say to put it in there for like two seconds. And then I got to wait until 15 seconds to see the results. So let's see how far in ketosis I am. So guys, this is what the actual chart looks like. It starts from negative. Then there's trace, small, moderate, large. And then when you dip this strip into your urine, it's going to come up whichever color, whichever step you are, how deep you are in ketosis. And yeah, that's how you'll know. So I'm gonna, I'm about to dip the strip in the in my urine right now, and then I'll show you guys what comes up. So I just dipped my ketone strip into my urine, and now I'm about to see where I am on the chart. And I am at moderate, so I'm definitely in ketosis, and I'm like halfway, well, more than halfway, a little bit over halfway on the chart deep into ketosis and I'm so excited like I'm at moderate which is a 4.0 wow wow I'm so happy that I'm actually on this diet like I'm deep into ketosis like bitch so guys if you guys would like to purchase these um, strips you could go to kissmyketo.com this video is not sponsored but that's where I got these strips from so I wanted you guys to know if just in case you guys were wondering where I got the strips from that's where I got them from so yeah your boys in, in ketosis yeah. in today's video I'm gonna be showing you what I ate in my first week of keto diet and how I lost 6.4 pounds and today I am making some cheddar biscuits like listen some keto cheddar biscuits I want to tell you baby I am ready for these biscuits I was just looking at random keto recipes online and I saw this recipe and I'm like yes I have to remake this tomorrow morning so I got up and I went to Target to get the ingredients that I needed so guys we have some coconut flour here which is 100% organic now in the keto diet you can only use coconut flour or almond flour you can't use regular flour we also have some shredded um, cheddar cheese right here we have some baking powder we have some black pepper we have some onion powder, we have some garlic powder, we have some parsley flakes, and we have some Himalayan salt, we have an egg right here, and we have some Kerry Bold grass fed butter. Now that's all the ingredients we're going to need to make our cheddar biscuits, and guys when I tell you these cheddar biscuits mimic the biscuits you would get at Red Lobster and girl. And when I tell you I love me a good five, six pieces of Red Lobster biscuits, girl, baby. I am so ready to make these biscuits, so yeah, let's go. Okay guys, so first and foremost, we're gonna need a teacup. This is where we're gonna put all our ingredients in and this is, this is gonna form our biscuits. So first thing first, we're gonna put 
one and a half tablespoons of butter. So we're gonna need one and a half tablespoons of this. So we'll just scoop that up real quick. One and a half tablespoons. One, now we need a half. There we go. Then we're gonna pop this in the microwave for 20 seconds. Okay guys, that's done. Now you wanna mix that up a little bit. Okay, now we're gonna add two tablespoons of coconut flour. Two tablespoons. So we're gonna grab our coconut flour right here. And we're gonna add two tablespoons. Then we're gonna add a quarter tablespoon of baking powder. This is what is gonna make our biscuits rise. Now it's time to add our seasons. We're gonna add some onion powder, just a little bit. Then we're gonna add some garlic powder. Then we're gonna add a little bit of black pepper. Then we're gonna add some parsley. You can add a good amount of parsley because you wanna give that red lobster biscuit effect. Then we're gonna add just like a pinch of salt. Then we're gonna mix that all up. Mix it up. Ooh, this looks good. Okay, after you mix that up, you're gonna add an egg. Then we're gonna add two tablespoons of water. Oh yeah guys, I forgot to mention that we're gonna also need whipping cream. And we're gonna add one tablespoon of whipping cream. Then we're gonna add a quarter cup of our shredded cheese. Yes guys, we need a lot of cheese because we're making cheddar biscuits. Plus, on the keto diet, you can never have too much cheese. Then we're gonna mix that all together. Oh, guys, this smells so good. Oh, this garlic, oh, this smells so good. So this is what it looks like when you mix everything together. And now we're gonna pop this in the microwave for three minutes. Okay, guys, so now it's done. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, wow, look at that. I'm gonna use a butter knife just to go around the edges, just so I'm able to take it out, and I'm gonna lay it in a plate and allow it to cool for two to three minutes. Wow, guys, look at this. If you guys could only smell this. Yo, in my house smells like red lobster biscuits, like for real. For real, for real. So I'm just gonna allow this to cool for two to three minutes and then I'm gonna slice it up into like three or four pieces. Okay guys, so meanwhile the biscuits are cooling. I'm gonna move on to the second half of my breakfast. So I'm about to make some eggs right now. So what I'm gonna do is use one tablespoon of butter. Then I'm gonna add one egg. A little bit of salt. A little bit of black pepper. Then I'm gonna add one cup of spinach. Eggs and spinach is done. Now it's time to move on to our bacon. So our bacon and eggs is finished. Now it's time to cut our cheddar biscuits. Okay guys, so we're just gonna slice this into four pieces. Ooh, the texture of this. Wow. This is amazing. So this is the first meal of the day, guys. I added some avocado on the side. And this looks so yummy. Ooh. Look at my red lobster biscuit. Come on, keto. Come on, keto. Mm -mm. Yo, these cheddar biscuits, though. Yo, red lobster. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Look at that yumminess, guys. Oh my God. Shout out to Keto Connect on YouTube. This recipe is delish. Delish. So guys, it's time for my second and last meal of the day. Now this meal doesn't take a lot of preparations because I already meal prepped it from yesterday. So I'm just gonna show you guys what I'm gonna eat. So I have some steamed cabbage here and I also have some baked chicken legs. So guys, I normally have a cup of cabbage so I'm just putting it into a container so I can measure it. I'm gonna have two pieces of these chicken legs. Pop that in the microwave. So guys, this is my second and last meal of the day. Added some avocado on the side with a little bit of salt and a little bit of black pepper. 
But yeah, this is my meal. Baked chicken, cabbage, and avocado. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. Make sure you go and try out the recipe that I provided for you guys. For the keto cheddar biscuits. Baby, trust me, you're gonna love it. It's better than red lobster biscuit. And you're just gonna lick your 10 fingers and you're just gonna want more. So yeah, try the recipe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Wait, 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 wait. I know you wasn't about to leave without subscribing. And while you're at it, click the bell right beside it so you can know every time we upload a video. And grow. Make sure you like this video, grow. And leave a comment down below, grow. Okay, grow. Okay. Right now. Body twins. Body twins. Body, 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 body twins. Body twins. Body twins. Body, 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 body twins. Body twins. Body twins. Body, 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 body twins.